All right, folks, so we're back here in the long drive and we are getting close. We're on the home stretch here to 100 days in hardcore survival. Uh, what if we were to die like right now? I would be so, I'd probably just walk away. Like I'd quit YouTube for the day and I'd be like, okay, I'm not gonna record anything else. And I'm just gonna walk away and go cry. Uh, but yeah, uh, we're getting really, really close to being done. Should, if I don't die, next episode should be day 100. But today, I've got plans. I would like to finish my little room on the back of the, the bus here. Uh, that way we can stick the cats up there. Uh, the problem is, it, we've been in like such a terrible like mountain area that I haven't even seen many good stops. So we're going to have to take whatever we can. There's a tower stop down there, but does the road even go near it? I'm not even sure. The road kind of sucks right now. I mean, we did get over the snowy mountains. Uh, that we were having troubles with last episode. Uh, but yeah, uh, hopefully we're going to find some good stuff here today. Maybe you guys hit that thumbs up button because it, I don't know, it helps me. Uh, oh, maybe you should hit the thumbs up button for that taxi. Uh, they look like they need a lot of help too. All right, you know what? Uh, we're going to drive into the night a little bit. I, I want to try to get over this next hill and hopefully... Uh, we'll camp out there. I'll get my binoculars out and we can go try to find a good stop here. All right. It is the next day. We're going to just get up and up, oh, up oh, on oh, wrong. There we go. Got the right button. What is that sound? It sounds like, so oh, is it all the poo that's in the door? By the way, I should probably clean that up. Okay. So we're on top of, well, we're somewhat on top of a hill. It looks like we do have a stop coming up. Um, I'm looking for pallets. Uh, a gas station's not going to have pallets. Oh my goodness. It keeps going up. Okay. Hold on. Look to the left. Uh, do we have anything out here? Watchtower. Uh, oh, well, hello, beautiful. There's a, uh, there's a haunted house. It's a little bit out of the way, but man, that would have the final pieces, uh, to probably finish the top of this. Okay, you know what? We're gonna have to do it. We got to. Uh, we gotta do it for the cats. All right, so we're just gonna pull off. I think I can make it up that hill. I mean, maybe it's not that bad looking. Like, it looks bad from here, but I feel like the terrain's gonna smooth out. It's just gonna be a gradual climb up to the haunted house. Uh, I really hope I'm not wrong. By the way, there's a tower stop over there, too. The tower stop, a lot of times, will have pallets up against the wall. Hmm. Uh, I'm thinking if we want to finish this little shelter for the cats, that might be the way we need to go. Uh, hold on, let's kind of round this a little bit, make sure there's not something just waiting around the corner, because, like, if there's, like, a diner or something, I'd be really happy. Uh, but it appears that that's not going to be a thing, so we're going to have to drive off the side of the mountain here. Uh, well, you know what? Good luck, everybody. Here we go. We. Oh, no, I forgot there's a cat still on the top. Uh, hold on, little Maxwell. I think he's got it. Oh, we might actually pick up a lot of speed here. Maybe we should go, you know what, let's go to the tower first since I think the momentum's gonna carry us over there. And then we'll shoot across to the haunted house. The road will be to the right. This will be fine. Uh, so tower stop, here we go. Uh, I think I've got a little bit extra ammo there in the back. Uh, we should be good to go. I don't know, the, the haunted house is gonna be a little bit scary. Uh, hopefully we got enough for it. Okay, here we are. Look at this. Okay, please tell me. Tell me you got pallets. If there's not pallets on the side of this thing, I'm gonna just drive by it and just go away. Uh, come on. Nothing's loaded in yet. Please. Oh, I see him. There's three pallets there. Uh, there's a board up on the top, which we might be able to use. Is there any mutants? That's the question. Am I gonna have to shoot anybody today? I'm, I'm hoping not. I'm hoping that I get to save my ammo for the haunted house, which I know that thing's gonna have mutants. Oh, there's five pallets here. Uh, that's not counting if there's any on the inside. Hold the phone. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Okay, so we got five here. So yeah, these, uh, I use these as my walls. So I think I should be able to let's see it should be two up i think i'm going to set them up like this that way we get a little bit more coverage i'm going to leave a little slot open that way you can jump down from the bus uh you don't have to jump over the wall uh this is going to look good also i think it's about to start raining on us you know the simple weather mod when we first installed it it really wasn't that active and then all of a sudden it's like hey it's going to rain a lot uh, in the desert still have yet to see that snow though i was really wanting to see the snow and the fog that the simple weather mod has okay so what i'm thinking here uh, if I've got stuff in the right position, I might need to move the couch forward just a, just a little bit. I think it, oh, it might be fine where it's at. All right, so I'm going to build the walls like this. That way it's higher up. Uh, so I'm thinking if I can plant this down, which I'm hoping this is going to look right. It's a little awkward place. It's awkward placing it this way opposed to the other way. Hold on, let's go clunk. Well, you know what? That actually worked out pretty good. All right, so we're going to do that. We're going to put another wall right beside it. And uh, the pooping area, we might have to move it around a little bit. I mean, ideally, I'd go find, like, another five pallets. Like, that would be just absolutely fantastic. By the way, I don't turn on, off collisions when I'm doing this. Now, a lot of people, when they see me struggling, they're like, just turn the collisions off. No, I need them on. That way I can attach 
uh, and try to be accurate and up against the other one. Why, why did that do that? Okay, I gotta do it again. Now I turn it off. All right, turn it back on. All right, so we got our walls up. Uh, let's go search the rest of this out. I'm gonna leave this little opening because I can squeeze through here. That way we can jump on and off the bus. Uh, the wall is not gonna be perfect. It's honestly kind of hard to stick those pallets like straight up like that. Uh, let's see what else we have in here. Do we have anything else useful? Uh, I got some cleaner, a little hatch in here. You know, I might rip off one of the pallets off the back that I was gonna use to try to mount the vehicles or like the, uh, the bike, which it proved to not work. Oh my goodness, red. Yo, I feel like this is a sign. Since we're on the home stretch, we might as well paint the vehicle red. Uh, so let me do that real quick. I'm gonna probably move a pallet. Uh, I think I only really wanna move like one. I think I wanna leave the other ones on the windows because obviously they kind of act like they're gonna be uh, uh, some sort of armor. So hold on, let's check this red out real quick. Ooh, that's nice. I feel like all my vehicles on the long drive end up being red. So, I mean, this just feels perfect. Okay, we're gonna take this one off here because I feel like this one isn't really doing us anything. Like I said, it was gonna originally be like a mounting uh, point. Oh, no, 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 wait, what What did I just do? It, it's somehow, am I still holding on to it? No, 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 Gra grab this. Why, why is this, flo here, float off this way at least. Uh-oh, did I break a pallet? Uh, I can't even grab this thing anymore. It's like, uh, <laughs> Um, I'm not really sure what's happening here. I might need an adult. Okay, well, you decide if you want to pop off here in a second. Let me go uh, search the rest of this place out. I'm debating if I want to use the boards, which I don't think I'm going to. I feel like they're just too big and bulky. I could maybe use them for a roof piece, but it would take several to cover it. Oh, here we go. Editor's favorite. Wait, am I peeing up into the fountain? I feel like that's what's happening here. Oh, I need to get some food, too. Got some in the bus, but you know what? There's a floor cookie over here. Mmm, yeah, floor cookies. Uh, also, I left another, well, that's a floor dookie. Okay, honestly, I can't grab this last. I feel like I actually just broke a pallet. So, you know what? We're gonna head off to the haunted house here. Uh, Maxwell's, you guys ready? Uh, I think I'm ready on oh, what's gonna happen. Why is it just like floating there? That pallet's kind of creeping me out. Why, why don't you just fling off? Fling, oh my goodness, it's like stuck. And I can't grab it. So yeah, we have a magical floating pallet at the end. Uh, I don't really get it, but you know what? It's a thing. All right, haunted house, here we come. A few moments later. All right, here we are. Oh, it's night. You know what? I think we're going to camp out in front. Could you imagine what the mutants are thinking right now? They're like, why is there a bus out front? And what are they about to do? <laughs> well, little do they know. I'm about to go in there and steal other pallets. Wait, is there a vehicle? Oh, I see a vehicle out there. I don't know really what it is. Oh, that's creepy. The mutant just fell out the top. Nah, you guys will be fine. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna just sleep here. Uh, just, yeah, don't mind me. That's fine. I'm just here with my cats. <laughs> we better, uh, let's close the doors just in case. I don't know if they can open these doors. Uh, also, we get a free drink of, uh, cactus water. So, you guys wanna know a little fun fact? By the way, it's the next day. Um, I don't have any more ammo on my- Oh, here he comes! Man, my AK has no more ammo. Here, you just- Yeah, you stay back there. Oh, 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 headshot. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. Let me roll- Uh, reload this real quick. I had a lot of ammo for everything else but my AK. Uh, I think we'll be fine, though. Hold on, let's get the shoddy out real quick. Uh, what car is that? Eh, pretty basic car. All right, here's pallet number one. Um, oh, normally, oh, I thought there was a couple under here. Uh, is that a, oh, there's a TV in there. Croissant, I don't know what's in that. Maybe we'll find another, like, Max. Oh, <gasps> well, <laughs> hello. Oh, look, a rifle that has no ammo. You know, I haven't run across a lot of rifle, uh, rifle ammo as of recent. Oh, is that more shoddy ammo? Okay, we got more shotgun ammo. I think I'm good right now. I need to keep moving. Um, let's see, look around. I hear at least two mutants. Uh, there's gotta be more pallets in here, right? Oh, he's not, maybe there's some pallets here in the bottom. Uh, oh, no, okay, anybody down here? No, just some food. Okay, kind of disappointed on the pallets. Uh, we got some wood pieces. I only got one pallet so far. Uh, I guess everybody's hanging out upstairs, Hold on. There might be somebody in here. Uh, oh, here we go. There's another pallet right there. That's good. Uh, swing this open. Hello? Nobody in the kitchen? Hold on, there's another gun there. Okay, it's got three bullets in it. No, uh, AKs right now. I was hoping to find one of those. All right, let's go upstairs real quick and clear it out, and then we can loot this place. Okay, clear, uh, looking good, okay. Where is everybody? I hear multiple people walking around. Wait, what? Uh, oh, I think it's somebody on the other side of this. Okay, yoink. Uh, oh, oh my goodness, I closed a mutant on. Does that, are we hitting him? Uh, hello? I don't know if that's actually penetrating the door. Uh, here we go. On, yeah, uh, uh, uh. 
I need you to stand a little close. No, don't do that. Oh my goodness. Okay. Dude, he's like stuck behind the door. Uh oh. I mean, I could just leave him back there. Okay, look around. Okay, there's one in here. Uh, let's go. Uh, oh, on. Oh, I, I cannot believe two shotgun sh like hits to the head doesn't take him out. Uh, oh, jeez. No, 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 no. Close, 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 close. Ooh. Ooh, hoo -hoo. That was close. Oh, I'm out of. Oh, I, I need to poop myself. Hold on. Here we go. Uh, uh. Yep. Oh. There we go. You know, I actually think it's only one of them left. Hey, buddy. Uh, 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 there we go. And I think the haunted house is officially clear. Okay, so in searching the rest of this out, what is that? Oh, really? Hats? I don't need hats. Uh, we got three pallets in here, which I don't think is enough. I could use one of the wood pieces. Oh, we got to grab the Maxwell real quick. You can't forget this. It's always good seeing one of these. I like adding them to the family here. All right, let's go stick you outside. Oh, sorry for bouncing you against the door there. Uh, we'll go grab the rest of the pallets. I'm going to pull the bus in real quick. Uh, that way I'm closer to the uh, loot. And uh, yeah, we'll start grabbing the stuff and hauling it out here. And hopefully, I don't know if we're going to finish the shelter. I'm hoping we do, though. Oh, my goodness. Is that the floating pallet? The floating pallet is now inside of the bus. Uh, what does that even mean? I, I still can't pick it up. I can move it. I feel like we've we've permanently broken that thing. Uh, that's that's one of the weirdest things I think I've ever seen. Okay, you know, it's fine. Okay, so this is what the walls look like. I got a back wall up. I've got some wood pieces over here. There's a couple still in the house uh, that we might be able to use, but I don't mind these. Actually, that is not a wood piece. That is a piece of stone. Uh, I can't... Wait, I can move this? Hold on. Can I move this? Yo, I mean, they're heavy, but... I mean, that might work. Hold on, what's the... Vi is that a, oh, I thought it was gonna be a technical. By the way, you know, I've been searching for that technical gun. I need to go ahead and explore. Oh, another pallet. Okay, nice. I didn't even think to check the back here. Uh, another uh, thing that I've been searching for is the technical gun, and I completely forgot that it was a separate mod that has the separate gun. Uh, so the technical is the truck with the machine gun on the back of it, and I was like, oh yeah, I'd love to find the detached machine gun so I could stick it up here. Well, guess what? Uh, I think it's a mod, so it's like you, you can't actually get it off the straight technical mod, but yeah, it's fine. Uh, eventually, maybe we'll get that machine gun at the top. Uh, where am I going to stick this one? It could act like a little cabana top. Maybe we don't enclose the whole thing. That way we can keep it open. We can see the cats in there, uh, but we'll put like a little shade up here at the top. I feel like this might actually work. Hon, can we lay this down? You know, honestly, it kind of gives you like a, a pooping shade. Um... I actually don't mind that. All right, I'm gonna go grab a couple more pieces of furniture and then I think we're gonna move some of the cats up here. I mean, I think it's gonna be safe. Okay, we place some baskets in here and hold on, let's get a, I want a light in here. So might aim this against that back wall and mount it about like that. There we go, we got a pooping light. <laughs> Okay, well, hold on. let's grab the Maxwell from up here. I uh, still want to mount a machine gun here in the front, but we now have like a, it's kind of a private area. I mean, it's still got the open roof here, uh, but my goodness, I mean, it looks about as good as it's gonna look for long drive standards, but I like it. Okay, backing out, our vehicle looks more ridiculous each day. All right, I think the road is to the, oh, do I still have the floating pal? Oh my goodness, really? Can you just, this is, this is distracting. I, I can't see right now. Okay. What if that kills us? I think it's collisions off and I somehow have like managed to drop it. By the way, I, I don't I don't see the road. Where's the road at? I think it's in front of us. Hold on. Uh oh, whew. There it is. It just kind of disappears. Okay, so we need to go up and over this mountain in front of us. Alright, well, we're just gonna cut right through the desert. Hopefully the floating pallet. There it goes. It's going to the back. <laughs> Oh, this is amazing. I like my little uh, cat forward up here. There. Uh, I'd like to close it off maybe a tiny bit more, uh, but I feel like there's enough like privacy screens there. How many pallets do we have attached to this bus? Like way too many. Uh, they got their little TV up there. You got the couch. You got the new baskets up there. Lights. It'll look good at night, so uh, we'll check it out then. But I'm going to cut straight across, hopefully get back on the road and continue our journey to 100 days. Folks, we're having technical difficulties. My bus just broke down. Uh, I think we burned the motor up. <laughs> Thankfully, there's not a mod that makes like permanent motor damage. Wait, is that a thing? Does anybody know? 
I, I don't think it is. Why can I not get out of here? I, I want to get out of my seat, please. I need to get back to take care of the engine. Oh, yeah, she's smoking. I, I feel like I might have run her out of oil, which I think we'll use the top compartment. Hold on. Can we check it real quick? Oh, she's a smoky boy. There's my turbo on there. Um, On the oil? I think, yeah, I might have to use the panel at the top to check it. Uh, I've got oil and everything. We're going to have to let it cool down. Uh, the road is up on that mountain up there. So I think we're going to be camping here uh, for the night. But we'll get to see what it looks like at night. This pallet is bugging me. I wonder if I left the doors open if I could get it to float out. It's like when you get a bug in your car and you're just trying to shoo it out the window. Like, that's what this pallet essentially is. Okay, come on, pallet. You've overstayed your welcome. The cats don't like you. You're making everybody uncomfortable. Uh, go out to the side. Oh, there it goes. Oh, oh. Hold on. Everybody say goodbye to the pallet. It's finally out. Goodbye, pallet. <laughs> I have no clue what happened. My only guess is that the collisions are off on it, and I somehow dropped it, and, like, it floated away. Uh, really, really awkward. My bike used to have tires and stuff on it, and I didn't steal those off the AI, and now it's extremely rusty. Did it break? You know, the bike's been hitting the back of the bus the whole time, and I feel like it might be broken. Hold on, where's my... Okay, this is not the... Where's the oil at? Oh, here we go. Uh, oil tank. Well, I've got a little bit of oil in there. It's not the most. Maybe I'm out of coolant. No, coolant's up to 7.3. Uh, I'll top it off with the oil here. Because, uh, yeah, it needs a little more. Is there a rabbit outside? Right, we'll just chunk a can at it. Uh, mount. Okay. Um, we better close our doors. We're just going to close our doors and go to sleep here. Okay. Oh, oh. Oh, no rabbits are getting us tonight. All right, it is the next day. Let's make it back to this road. I didn't even look at my light at night. I'm a little disappointed in myself, but uh, the bus uh, the bus seems to be running good. Everything's fine. It cranked right back up. Hopefully it doesn't overheat anymore. Well, folks, we meet an old arch nemesis, the Sandstorm. Uh, I swear, this is like the same one that's been following us for like several episodes. Um, yeah, uh, it's over there. I don't think we're going to run into it. Uh, I, I wish they would spawn on the road more because I feel like it'd be a fun challenge, uh, but maybe not yet. Uh, maybe we do want to get to the day 100, uh, but we, yeah, we found the road again. I mean, this has been a good journey today. You know, I kind of felt bad the past couple episodes have been kind of like we're just surviving the road. It didn't really get to build on to what I was wanting to do to the top of this bus. By the way, are we, are we getting followed? Oh, I'm smoking. Okay. Well, it's black smoke. I think it's when it's white smoke that's bad because it's overheating. Uh, but yeah, uh, back on the road. Let's see how far we can get. I can see some green over the next hill. So I'm assuming we're heading towards a grass biome. Uh, also, there is something up here against the road. What stop is this? Oh, this is that really tall garage. Sometimes you see a diesel in there. Uh, I've seen that spawn in several times. I think, and you guys can comment down below. Do we finish, if I make it a day 100, do we finish it here in the bus and then maybe move on? Uh, if we do, oh, that is a diesel in there. I think that's been pretty consistent, hadn't it? Uh, oh yeah, there's an engine out there. Oh, it's a little flatbed one. Uh, a couple tires. Hold on, I can check my tires. Uh, well, the bottom tire looks pretty good. Uh, here, let's go ahead and stop off here. This is going to be a good point. To, oh, yeah, look, there's all the grass. Uh, so we're definitely heading in that direction. I don't see any diners. Well, I say I don't see any diners. What is that over there? Is that a diner? Uh, no, it's a, I think that's the little convenience store. Oh, hold on, keep that light on. Uh, oh, so hard to hit those buttons uh, sometimes. Oh, man, this thing's actually on. Oh, check around. Oh, shotgun. Uh, one shot in there, a little bit of fuel. Uh, let's see what's in this tank. Oh, it's oil. Uh, here, I'm gonna take this actually. I'm gonna go fill up my containers with it. Yeah, it's actually, uh, the diesel's in pretty good shape. Uh, not gonna lie. Uh, let's see, we got one good tire here. Uh, very bad wheel. Hold on, check my tires. I think my tires have held up relatively well. That one there, no, that looks about the same condition. Uh, I think maybe this one could get changed out. Uh, oh yeah, definitely. The tread on this one's not as good as the one over there. So here, let's take this off here. Uh, I'm gonna steal that and boom, do a little tire swap. You know, it's always good to do a little bit of preventative maintenance to your vehicle. Uh, you don't want the failures and the bad stuff to happen uh, while you're out on the road, so you might as well take care of it early. Oh, let's go ahead and bust this open. What's in here? Another Nat Maxwell? Uh, no, fuel can. But what's the fuel can got in it? Uh, anything that I can use. Uh, no, it's gas. Nope, not gonna be able to use that. All right, I'll grab a couple more things and then we'll get back on the road. By the way, I had to check on where the, uh, the Maxwell Cat is. It is behind the TV now, but it seems to be staying in there, though. Also, there's a blue bus over here that's having all sorts of itchy. Sorry, little buddy, we can't help you there. Uh, he's gonna have to manage. Well, the journey goes on. You know what? 
if we survive the day 100, that episode should be the next one. So let's get the hype up. I don't know what that taxi is doing. Uh, but yeah, now we're going to continue our journey here. Oh, maybe you need to dodge a car too. Uh, thank you guys for all the love and support on this series. It has been truly one of my favorite things that we've done. Not just the whole long drive series, but this like hardcore survival. Uh, I have been having a blast and I really look forward to recording these episodes. So thank you guys for watching and we will see you guys on day 100.